Howdy folks, my name is Lanzo19, and welcome back to Let's Play The Little Martian. Alright. We have eaten. And let's head back. So we still need to come up here. Ooh, there's actually some more magma ore. Let's get that first. Might as well get all of it while we can. We will have to... Let's test if regular wood works in the uh, generator. I have to come back with a shovel for ash, I suppose. Regular wood doesn't work in the generator. I think we can get across without air. Without getting more air, I should say. I think it took about half last time, so... Should get across, and in an emergency, we can always pop a oxygen pack. So now the question is, what's inside these magma ores? What can we use tourmaline for? Is there anything we can do with fire thorns? Do fire logs do anything that regular wood does not do? Yeah, we will have to bring plant matter over there. So there's not much over there. There isn't much left over there, just the ash. I doubt the ash has much uses right now, but I like to collect a little bit of everything if we can. Although our main chest is about to be full. Lab is not working right now, right? So we don't have to worry about that. The stove could be working, but I don't know any of the recipes. Some of these currents just to buy me time. All right. Okay. Has anything opened up for us? I don't remember if anything needed tourmaline. Silicon. Quartz. Quartz might have been what I was thinking of, but. Ruby. Rubies. Let me get that on the soundboard, man. Those can that we cannot use. Okay. I guess that brings the question of what's in magma. I suppose it might be possible that we can smelt the tourmaline somehow, but. I have to get a, use good old fashioned wood for this, though. have hit the point of uh, not much else left to do in the game. We'll have to see if like the other locations on the map have anything. Oops, that's not the way we do this. Do it like that. So I suppose we should build another one of these, huh? Probably didn't need that midway one. Aluminum, light bulb, and steel. Hey, okay, generator. Probably running out of scrap here soon. Of those storage boxes, man. The storage boxes take up a lot of scrap. Cannot be replenished. Oh, 
oxygenate before we go. I don't know why I keep going into the base first. Alright. I would say next potential area would be down yonder way. Maybe where we found that uh, mine cart. Yeah, unless we find something else here soon. I believe this will be the last episode in the series. For now. We'll revisit it once the new content's out. Absolutely. Do want to grab that scrap, but we can always come for it later. Alright, where's this thing? Mine card at? It was over here. You're going to see if we can do something with this later, too. Island out over that way. It looks like it's just a normal island, though. It could link up to another one. Alright, looks like we might have another one over here. No. I'm glad I didn't place that. This way, perhaps. Okay. Gotta do the module first, then that, and this. And let's go gather some plants real quick. I think mushrooms can go in. I prefer not to use mushrooms for this, though, because we like to eat them. I'm going to put this plant in there, and then we'll go a little further out and get some new plants, because I'm almost out of oxygen. I don't want to pop a thing. We have a plant, so we should use it. All right. Sound of progress, my friend. I'm using the hammer on the generator and stuff may have helped. So that's one more thing we can do. So I guess we can do that right now because this isn't terribly far away from our base. Let's go grab the hammer even though it causes more issues than it solves. <laughs> Man, this area is barren. I don't remember if we're to the left or right of this lava. Daisies can go in. Our grass and plants can go in. I doubt we'll need this much, but grabbing it all the same. Slam one of those bad boys down. All right, hammer, hammer time. Do, 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 do. All um, Did my best to put an M inside of Omxigen. <laughs> Take these currents again, if you don't mind. Om nom nom, om nom. Alright, head back to the temporary base and see where that path down there leads. For all I know, all the islands are the same. They might have different codes on them. Do 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 do. Good grab scrap, but we'll probably be restarting when the new patch comes out, because I'm sure save compatibility is going to be iffy. <laughs> Plus, there's lots of stuff that we've, like, torn down. And if, like, it ends up that, like, I don't know, sisal trees regenerate or something. Then we'll have 
will be really sad that we took down all of the sizzle trees. <laughs> Let's put it that way. I don't know why I backed out. Didn't need to. Did I just get a second plant out of that for free? I have to watch the footage. Check the footage. Check the footage. Feel like I did though. Alright, send me. Oh, not be anything out here. Looks like this. Uh oh. Oof. Seems that I've made a mistake. That's okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. I think I did duplicate one there, but I think I only duplicated it in theory and not in practice, <laughs> if that makes sense. Oh, stuck on everything. Kind of weird that we can't go across that. That might be a little thing to take a look at. Pretty sure there is multiple islands. It could be that we're just looking in the wrong spot. Oh. Can't check this stuff now though. You know I repair you bed. No yes is the answer. I can click on them and move them. Oh, is this a working campfire? It is. Interesting. <laughs> this way, perhaps. Yeah, we can't go through the deep water. I'd say if there is... You know what? We should grab that GPS that we've never used. <laughs> I don't know if it just, like, shows what cardinal direction we're going or what. But let's go take a look at it. Maybe it shows us the actual map. And then we wouldn't have to just guess about where things are. <laughs> Probably a good idea. Okay. Some oxygen in us first. There we go. Okay. I imagine I left the GPS in here. I did. Okay. Uh, okay. It only shows us where we've been. It's good that it shows you even if you've uh, already explored it, though. Or if, like, you didn't have the GPS device on you, it's still populated. Could be something attached down here, maybe. Doesn't look like there's any connections from there, but looks like the next one may be up there. I'm not going to save the game, since we've built a base on a pointless location. We may even do long expeditions with our oxygen tank here. And just reload. If there's nothing of interest up there. If there's something of interest, then we can call it and get a real expedition going. Being able to thread the needle between trees would be nice. I don't know if there's the ability in this game to 
It might take a lot of coding to program in things to have specific blockers that aren't just the square around them. And it took off from the wrong point here, so it came from this way. It's okay. Ice sheet. Oh, nothing here though. Cat. Unless ice itself can be dug up. With the shovel. Yeah, since this is the last video, I'm not gonna run us back home for oxygen here. I'm just gonna use our oxygen tanks and eat our food. And we'll see just what else we can find. Sulfur we haven't been able to pick up. Maybe we can grab it with the shovel. I don't think I've seen any recipes that need sulfur, though. It is interesting to point... Oh, there's a sign here, at least. Interesting to point out that there is everything you need for gunpowder here. There was the aluminum oxide and then also sulfur. There's code for three. Again, maybe a bad spoiler. Can't get across there. Moving the berry bushes would be awesome, but it is a lot of... It would take the difficulty out. It's kind of like when you move the bushes and don't starve. Of course, in don't starve, you have to uh, re-fertilize them with poop. <laughs> if you move them. But if you're, like, moving out of a location, it's a pretty good, pretty good deal. No connection, huh? Yeah, very close. This one's there. I think we might have seen that there wasn't a path down there, but we'll go check. We got time, we got time. 25 minute day at videos, two a day. One at 8 a.m., one at 12 p.m. <laughs> okay. I actually do kind of find that strange. I was looking at the analytics, not just of my channel, but just like general analytics too, like when people are on and stuff, like also on like Steam. And you expect like there would be a peak. I don't know. There's a peak at noon, not on Steam, but on like YouTube and stuff. Because people are on lunch break, I assume. And then you assume there would be one after work, right? There would be one from, like, 3 to 6 or something, right? But there actually isn't. There's, like, a very small peak in there. That's when, basically, when I decide to stream. 3 p.m. to 5. But, the actual second peak is at 8 a.m., <laughs> I guess it's kids waking up in the morning, but I don't know. They'd have to be kids that aren't going to school because it's during the weekdays, too. I guess in some areas, maybe they go to school at like 8, but not where I live. You have to get up at like 6.30 to get on the bus at 7. <laughs> nah, it's more like 7.20, I think, usually. A little bit more out here, but they don't seem to be offering anything new. Keep searching, though. That's a dead end up there. Good to know. Realize our oxygen is getting low. I like to run it down to the wire. Usually when it beeps is a good time, I think. I don't think we can make that diagonal. If tree logic applies to water, then... <laughs> if 
we would not be able to make that diagonal. Interesting thing is there was... We did get tip number three, so there's a tip number two somewhere, right? I think we had tip number one. Or hint number one. Seeing much though, boys. Unless there's something hidden in there. Be nice to be able to scroll the GPS. Across the English Channel here. Okay. Back on the mainland. Those we'll take a look over here. Can I get there in four minutes? Don't know. Oh, this isn't the mainland. Now nah, we cross the English Channel. There we go. It's a fairly big island. It doesn't do anything, but it's fairly big. Technically, I can get some air here and not have to waste our last bottle. We might need this one to actually get to where we're going. Oh, that was much higher above the the base down here than I expected. Kind of close this down. Probably could have made it to the main base faster and get into this one. There it is. All right. So next series, while we're waiting for this game to update, will be Cataclysm, but I'm going to go back to point A. I don't think I've actually played point A. I think I joined during point B. So it might be interesting just to see a version of the game that I've never seen before. I know they did some very odd things back then. So I'll be curious to take a look at that. And then also just, I think I enjoyed the gameplay a lot better in those older versions. I'll try to see like, what's, what's my favorite point letter? <laughs> that makes any sense. Like point A, point B, point C, point D, point E. I have a feeling I'm not going to like uh, F. <laughs> We'll see. Probably hit up our base before we go here. Squeeze a bit more O2 into us. Point might as well sprint, huh? Send it, brother. Definitely much faster when he's sprinting, but can't quite tell if this is a dead end or not. Okay, it is. Running around at the speed of sound. Places to go, gotta follow my rainbow. Here's the dead end, but I'll make sure. Nothing. And the final place is going back up across the river this way and going down that other island. Down in here. That's the last spot we have to check. 
I lost a single frame. I'm so angry. Fortunately, we can't sprint in the water. As we've discussed on Marriott occasion. Hopefully there'll be a boat. I don't mind if we have to if swimming slow, but then having an alternative to two swimming would be nice. Don't think we can make it through that little gap. As previously discussed, this does appear to be the end though here. That's it. Can't scroll around, so I can't tell for sure. I think that was a dead end there, too. But we're all out of time for this episode. I hope you all, well, for the series for now. If you enjoyed, remember to hit the like button. Keep the conversation going in the comments, and subscribe if you want to see more. Until next time, hope you have a good day.